And you look at the diagram which is for a circular arc. I mean, there is a, this is x axis, y axis. You have a diagram for arc like this where radius is r, and <coughs> you have two angles theta and theta. Centroid is somewhere here. And that distance, the centroid from the center. That's given at the back of the book, and that's the top left corner. And this distance is r sine theta over theta. So <coughs> for the problem you're working with, r was <coughs> 300, and theta was 45. You divide this by pi over 4. So that's going to be 4. I can multiply this with this. You get 1,200 over pi sine 45. Now that's not the coordinates. That's this distance. So to find coordinates, you need to drop a perpendicular. And that's going to be x3 bar. So from that figure, x3 bar should be this distance, which is 1,200 over pi sine 45. And you got to multiply this by cosine 45. So <coughs> that's 1 over root 2, that's 1 over root 2, that's 1 half. This thing is going to come out to be 600 over pi. And we know that's also y3 bar. So we <coughs> have everything we need. And <coughs> this thing here is 150 pi. This thing here is 600 over pi. This thing here is another 600 over pi. This thing here is zero. Now we do the products. This column with this, this column with this, and this column with this. This is going to come out to be 75,000, zero, and 90,000. This times this gives you a zero, and you get a 75,000, and then you get a 90,000. We're going to do this times this. That becomes 100,000. That's the first one. The second one is also 100,000. The last one is zero. <coughs> then we do additions. <coughs> we add everything in this column. We add everything in this column. Same thing here, we add everything in this column as well as this column. <coughs> now this column is going to be the total length. That's the summation over Li. This one is <coughs> summation x. I mean, taking sum over i, x i bar Li. This one is <coughs> y i bar Li, again, the summation over i. And the last one, again, is summation over C i bar L i. We're just adding all those things. That's just sum. And if you go to the actual numbers, this is going to be 47, 14, 71, 24. This one is 165,000. This one is same, 165,000. This one is 200,000. So the coordinate x bar, that's going to be 147124, 165,000. Coordinate y bar will be 147124, 165,000. Then you get c bar, the same length, 
four, then you have two hundred thousand. And then you just need the actual numbers S1, 1, 2, 1, 5, MM, same number. And the last one is 135, 94 millimeters. 